Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why would they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town. Very special feel to it. So we're up and running. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Miranda. He's got such good defensive technique and timing. And the fact that he, he gives away very few fouls is, is testament to that, Peter. He's strong, he's good in the air too, and his experience means that other players feel just a little more confident and assured when playing alongside him. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. It's going to be another throw. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out... It's Gabriel! João Miranda gets good distance on it. Varela. De Arascaita. And the shot! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. Alan battles to win it back. Everton. Just brushed off the ball there. Out to the right. And the weighted pass. Looking for space out wide. The defence can get it clear. Everton gets the better of his man. Striding forward, facing goal. Alisson. Rafinha drives it forward. Tries to stroke it through. Goalkeeper's ball. De Arascaita. Jao Miranda gets rid without sophistication. Alan. Everton. Well, players of his stature just live for moments like that. Another really important contribution as we near half-time, and it can make such an impact on each mindset. Flamengo are so well-practiced in the art of keeping the ball through wonderful passing and movement, and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. He's got options out wide. Eater. Chills one in. Chance! A decent effort as the first half draws to a close. And there we are. Off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. 
Flamengo head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. And we are already promptly back underway. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Eiter. Eiter delivers. Felipe Luis with the clearance. Allen. So still just a goal between them. Felipe. So Jim, what are you thinking? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Plays it out to the flank. He's left his man. That's what has to be done now. No question about it. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Felipe. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Well, they've got to deny him time and space, and, and that's one way of ensuring it. The Arascaita. Flamengo got their goal at the Everton! This surely this time! It's a goal! And surely now the results beyond doubt! Alves did well the first time, nothing he could do about the follow-up. That's just top-notch, showed exactly why he follows it up every time. Keeper struggles to hold on to it, ball breaks kindly. He's always about. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Flamengo grab a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. And here's Kajeri. De Arascaita. He's played him through. Gabriel. And it's Felipe. Allen. Oh, he's got the ball glued to his feet. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Forward tracking back like that. Always appreciated by the crowd. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level. He's tried one. And the referee brings it to a close. So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance and a result which is well deserved. Your reflections then, Jim. Flamengo simply made their superiority.